So Zach, first goal this season and uh, what a time to get it. Yeah, to be honest, I'm still speechless, I'm absolutely buzzing. Um, got to be patient, stuff like that. Gaffer just keeps telling me to run to the goal. And uh, I did it tonight and luckily it fell for me and I got a goal. <laughs> <laughs> Just on the game, then obviously you know it was it was quite a tough game out there. It looked it, um, but you know even without the red card, it looked like a deserved win tonight. Yeah, I think so. Obviously, Forest Green have just come down and they've got really good players, really experienced players, an experienced manager, and we knew they'd be difficult to break down. I think like a lot of teams will do this year, they kind of came here to sit deep and catch on the counter, which has worked for teams. So you can kind of understand it. But I thought the first half we moved the ball really well without really creating anything major. Um, and when we went in at half time, the gaffer just said, Look, you need to be patient, stay patient. He was like, We don't have to score in the 46 minute, we can score in the 90, whatever. He was like, Be patient, a chance will come. Um, and I think we all believed it, and then luckily one fell to me. So. Yeah, you mentioned patience. Obviously, when the red card happened, obviously the expectation comes from the crowd, and obviously with yourself, you, you're the one that managed to grab the goal. So if you could just talk us through your goal and how it came about. Yeah, I think, like you said, when they got the red card, it was like even bigger for us to just keep the ball and the gaffer pulled Zoe straight away and said like look keep the ball in play as much as you can they'll get tired there'll, there'll be a chance and then I can't even remember how it came about all I remember is it got to Reese and I thought I was in and Reese, I just screamed at him and he just laid it on the plate for me and then yeah I just whacked it in. Yeah obviously it's a busy week three games within a week as well so how do you find that as a player to sort of build yourself up for three different match days? It, it is difficult but like we prep as well as possible we was in Sunday doing recovery we trained yesterday um, to prep for this game, we got tomorrow off, and then we'll go again Thursday, Friday, and then we're in, we're in all week. So obviously we've got the Saturday, Monday game, so it is really difficult, especially physically. But I think when we play the way we play, it's easier to play three games a week how we play it than the other teams. Um, like they're obviously running around chasing after the ball, and we're kind of letting the ball do the move, the movement. So it is tough mentally and physically, but it's, that's the league, isn't it? Yeah, and obviously your confidence now must be sky high heading into the weekend. Yeah, I'd like to think so. I wish I, yeah, I hope I can follow it up, but we'll, we'll wait and see.